Hi everybody, I hope everybody's doing well. I am so happy to be back on YouTube. In today's video, I am going to show you how to do three easy nail designs using dried flowers. So if you want to learn, please keep on watching. For design number one, I am going to apply white acrylic at the tip, blending it towards the cuticle area. And the color Stella from my The Nails Queen collection, starting near the cuticle area and blending it towards the tip, connecting the two colors in a subtle and seamlessly way right in the middle to achieve an ombre or baby boomer. These layers are going to be thin since this ombre's purpose is to serve as a foundation for the design. If necessary, to achieve a more perfect ombre, you can moisten your brush with monomer and smoothly go over where the two colors meet. On this occasion, I am using these two dried flowers. To adhere them to the nail, I am using brush on nail glue for precision and with the tip of my finger, I will remove the excess adhesive. Then with an orange stick and a wax called Embelly Jelly on the tip, I will place the flowers in their place and again, with the tip of my finger, I am going to press down to secure them. Once the flowers are secure, to add a little bit more of detail, I will adhere some of these pieces of gold leaf using my brush moisten with a little bit of monomer. Now, using clear acrylic, I will encapsulate the entire nail, I will let it dry and then I will remove the excess and also shape the nail. After cleansing the nail, to finish it off, I am applying a layer of gel top coat, which I will cure under an LED lamp for 60 seconds. And well, my loves, this is the final result of look number one. Let me know in the comments down below what you think. Moving on to look number two, I am going to use the same white acrylic I previously used with the difference that I am going to apply a slightly thicker layer because I am going to implement the wire slash doll blade technique to cut out the acrylic and create a geometrical style. In this portion of the video, I am using the same technique from my three easy nail designs video that I am going to link up here for you guys, where I explain more in depth the execution of this technique. After the acrylic dries, to perfect the line, I use a hand file and before applying the remaining layer, using the same color scheme from the previous design, I dust off the shavings for a cleaner finish. After having completed the base of this design, I will use a dry flower similar in size to the ones on look number one, and the rest will be dried flowers of a much smaller size. I am going to repeat the same process in order to adhere the flower to the surface of the nail. I wanted to show you on screen how these tiny flowers are packaged, the colors I chose, and also how I cut them with little scissors so that I can add them to the nail using my brush with a bit of clear acrylic on the tip. To achieve a contrast of colors and texture, and for more detail, I will also add some of the pieces of gold leaf. Now, it is time to encapsulate and repeat the same process from look number one to finalize the design. And ta-da! Here is the final product of look number two. Which one is your favorite so far? I sure cannot choose as always. <laughs> now moving on to the third and last look for this video. <laughs> I am going to create a similar baby boomer to the one from look number one. Thank you. 
After achieving the ombre, I will use dried flowers similar to those of look number two, also pieces of gold leaf, and I will apply them diagonally, repeating the same exact process, just in a different direction. Now, it is time to encapsulate the entire nail and repeat the same process. As you can see, these designs are very easy to accomplish, yet very beautiful. This is definitely an effective way to increase income and satisfy your clients with a little delicate touch. And here you go, my beautiful people. This is the final product of look number three. I hope you all enjoyed this video. And if you did, please like, share, subscribe. I will see you guys next time. Pink kisses to all of you. I love you all very, very much. And God bless you. Mwah.